Hi hey everybody, got a quick tip to share with you tonight. I'm about to feed the log perch I have in my native tank here. It's a bottom dwelling fish, it's a very shy fish and it is a very delicate and finicky eater. So I'm trying to get some uh, brine shrimp or some mysis shrimp rather to the bottom of the tank before all the minnows in the tank go crazy on it. Now one way you can do this is simply by dumping so much of it in there it overwhelms the uh, water column fish and they don't get all of them and some of them make it to the bottom. Another way you can do it is to put the brine shrimp or in this case I'm using mysis shrimp uh, directly to the bottom and you can do that simply by using a piece of PVC pipe and if you want to make it extra easy you can even use a funnel. So what I'm going to do is put the funnel in the top I've got my little bit of mysis shrimp here already thawed out. They're the little frozen cubes. You simply put your tube in the water down to the bottom wherever you want to disperse the shrimp or whatever you're pouring in there and pour it in. Now, of course, in that case, I was pouring it through so vigorously, I was trying to make sure I washed everything out of the PVC pipe, and I even had some bubbles washed down and through. So that definitely blasted some of that mysis shrimp down into the little nooks and crannies. It got it down in between the small spaces in the gravel, as well as underneath some of the larger rocks. So the crayfish will certainly enjoy a lot of that and of course the mosquito fish and other minnows that are in the tank will also be able to pick away at that and nibble at it but that certainly increases the chances of those log perch being able to get to them. So thanks for watching, hope that was a helpful little tip for somebody, hope you enjoyed. Don't forget this one is my 40 gallon native tank and I will see you real soon in the next one.